Welcome to the Plush Toy Showcase. In today's video, we'll be taking a look at the Wild Republic Ikokin Crocodile. Now this is a pretty awesome looking crocodile plush toy. I mean, just look at that menacing crocodile face. It's really awesome looking. But first, let's have an overview of this toy. So there's the side there, and the top. The other side, and the belly. The back here with his long tail. And the front with his awesome crocodile looking face. Now this toy is a nice size as well. So if you measure from the tip of his nose right down to the tip of his tail, you're looking at 50 centimeters or 19.5 inches long. Now if you measure from his nose down to the base of his tail here, you're looking at about 12 inches. So it just depends on which way you measure it to get the proper length, but this is quite a long toy. Now width wise, if you measure from his back legs, because that's basically his widest point, you're looking at about 20 centimeters or eight inches. So quite a wide toy as well. Height wise, if you measure it from the top of his eye here down to his front foot, you're looking at about 14 centimeters or 5.5 inches. So not too tall, but it's still a really nice size toy. A very nice size crocodile, not too large, but not too small either. He does sit quite low to the ground, as crocodiles do, so that's quite accurate. But he's a really nice sized toy, and he's got some really nice details as well. But first, with an Ecokin series. So the Ecokins are basically toys that are made with 100% recycled fabric and plastic fiber fill. Essentially how they do this is they take water bottles and they make it into fiber to make the toy. So a 12 inch Ecokin like this crocodile would take 16 water bottles to make. And it's quite amazing when you think about it that they can take 16 recycled water bottles and make it into a toy like this. And it, just because it's recycled doesn't mean it's not soft. This fur is incredibly soft. Same with the material inside. The padding is very soft as well. So even though it's a recycled toy, it is very soft and very nice to play with. It looks really nice as well. They've done a really good job at it. So let's go into those details. First off, you've got some really nice details in the face here. So you've got this really nice crocodile looking eye. So it's like gold on the outside and brown on the inside. And it's sewn into his face there. Really nice, it gives a really nice character to this crocodile. Same with these teeth sticking out his jaw. Again, they are sewn to the muzzle there. And he's also got some nice little black nostrils on his end of his snout there as well. Now this green fur is a nice dark green, very soft to the touch. You can easily pat this guy quite nicely. Same with his muzzle here. Going down his back here, you've got these little scoots. There's two rows of them. Now these are just thin pieces of material. There's no padding inside of them, but they do have a bit of hardness. So when you pat them down his back here, you will feel those little bumps that are your scoots. But they are nice and soft and they do stand out and they do give him a nice kind of crocodile look there. Then going down to his long tail here, which is a nice long tail. And of course you can move it quite easily as well. Uh, it looks quite nice and is also very soft. And this whole toy is very nicely padded, like I mentioned. Like he's got some nice padding in here, all through his tail, in his body and his head as well. Now flipping him over, you've got a nice kind of cream belly here, which is also nice and soft to the touch. Just like the top here, it's even softer than the green. So if you feel the top here, this is very soft material, very nice to touch, but his belly feels just that slightly bit softer. He's got some nice legs here as well. These legs are padded as well. There's no extra weight or anything. They are just padded. And each leg and foot has three little toes on it. Same on the other side. It's from the bottom. You can sort of see the little toes. They're pretty cool looking. And of course, these can help him stand up like that. So he looks like a crocodile. He 
He stands on them quite nicely, but again, he's quite low to the ground, so his belly basically touches the ground as well. Now this guy is very playable. So if you wanted to play with him, you could easily do so. He's not too big that you can't hold him across the back, so you could easily play with this guy with no problem. Or just have him there as a little companion that you can pat. He's very soft and he's a very nice looking little crocodile. Just look at that menacing crocodile face. It's pretty cool looking. Overall, I think Wild Republic have done a pretty good job with this crocodile. He looks like a crocodile. He's got some cool character in his face there, and he's incredibly soft as well. You know, considering this is a recycled toy made out of water bottles, it's quite astounding that Wild Republic have taken 16 water bottles and made it into an awesome looking crocodile like this. So it's a pretty cool looking toy. So if you're a fan of crocodiles, or you're just a fan of animals in general, and you'd like some plush toys, and this is quite a cool looking plush toy to get. Anyway guys, that was the Wild Republic Ecokin Crocodile. I think he's a pretty awesome looking crocodile, so I would definitely recommend him if you are a fan of these type of toys. Anyway guys, if you liked this video, then please hit that like button as it really helps out a lot. Don't forget to subscribe and enable notifications so you don't miss any of my new videos, as I'll heaps more plush toys up very shortly. Thanks again for watching guys, I'll see you in the next one.